Hello Capricorns and welcome into Tuesday, November the 5th, 2024. I hope you guys are doing well. It is your girl Jazzy J here on this mic and this is Earth Vibes Tarot, your favorite Capricorn only channel. But y'all know y'all are all very welcome here to messages. I'm just getting this light together better for us. There we go. Sit back, relax, take a chance, my love. Smash your like buttons, leave a comment down below. Just don't forget to make sure that y'all are subscribed. Look at our new llama. To the channel for more content and for more of me okay so we are piggybacking off of the short youtube short for tuesday talking about a magnetic connection that is coming into your life now i didn't explain in the short that the bottom of the deck was the divine masculine energy followed by dreams and illusions and the energy of independence so it does feel like here there is somebody that's coming into your life who has a genuine um, healed energy. This person is definitely, um, they're giving off like water energy. So they may have water somewhere in their chart that is very prominent. So it could be their sun, moon or rising sign. Um, this person is definitely very strong willed. I do feel like they're wanting to come into some sort of solid connection. And with independence, I do feel like this person is single. I do not feel like this person has any type of attachment to them. They're definitely been dealing with themselves, their own energy and trying to heal. So let's go ahead and keep going to see what else needs to come through here. Make sure you guys smash that like button, leave a comment down below. Don't forget to make sure you are subscribed. I effed up my finger, you guys, at the gym, so just please be patient with me um, the next week or so as I try to heal. Show us what we need to see here, please, for this magnetic connection for Capricorn. Okay, okay. Wow. So there definitely is some sort of hidden truth. Now, what I want to say about this hidden truth energy, you know this person. This is not going to be somebody that is brand, brand spanking fucking new, like, oh, you just met this motherfucker on the street. No, this is somebody that you know, you or know about, right? And this person may have dabbled in conversation here and there, may not have necessarily been like the best communicative energy, but it feels like this person has something they want to speak about, something they want to say in relation to a date night, in relation to the energy of uh, going out, being together, trying something new, dating each other dating one another this is their move they're making the move they're making the move there are no if ands or buts about it this person is making the move capricorn and i absolutely love this why because it shows how this person is uh being energetically um proactive right being energetically proactive around this loving situation so let's go ahead and pull tarot deck where is y'all where is that y'all i'm crazy i'm looking at the deck over there and sitting right here my lord anyway <laughs> show us what we need to see here please spirit for capricorn show us what we need to see here please for capricorn sun moon rising venus and jupiter Okay. Okay, so I think like maybe this is somebody that's been um they're saying watching you. So whether this person has been watching you, keeping an eye on you here, Capricorn, this person wants to communicate something uh towards you i do feel like with the energy of the lovers and the magnetic connection energy this person feels like the two of you have some sort of uh commitment to share with each other in this lifetime um so just keep your heart and your soul open to whatever that may be i do feel like there is this what is being communicated is emotional right and we see that with the queen of cups and i feel like this person is going to be coming straightforward you know speaking their speaking how they feel um speaking on what you know has been on their heart has been on their mind um i do feel like there is a lot that this person may have been dealing with ten of swords not necessarily speaking on i do feel like there may be a conversation like that the two of you have like a very strong um and honest type of communication that may come from this situation
And this, the way this person comes forward may be because of what has been said by you in the past or what has been recently said. And we have the Four of Pentacles. Yeah, I do feel like this is about information or about feelings that you haven't been yet privy to, how they feel. Nine of Cups. And Strength. There's this feeling of fulfillment and it almost feels as though this person feels like this connection or the energy that you give off is very fulfilling to them, like in all ways, meaning the way that you carry yourself, what you do, how you treat them, all that energy. It's like it makes them feel good. And I feel like there's something about finding the confidence, finding the power, because there's something with the Ten of Swords energy as well. Mm -hmm. This is definitely an Emperor, Divine Masculine, Masculine energy. This person has been dealing with something heavy in their life. I'm not 100% sure about what it is, but they've been dealing with something very heavy in their life. Um, I do feel like they've been dealing with a physical loss. Um, I do feel like this person has been trying to process uh, this energy and they just, they've been in a position where it's been hard to pull themselves out of. Um, this person is definitely very hesitant um, and a little bit resistant to the energy as well, but there is this sense of a confident draw because we have the masked offer holding back and be gentle yeah there's something that's up with this person that you're gonna have to just like give it time because this person may be going through something so pivotal for themselves that it's very hard for them to even comprehend right and they it may be to the point where they have lost somebody in their life or um been in a very low place because of something like this and they've had a hard time coming out of it if you guys have not already done so please make sure you guys smash that like button if you guys would like a personal reading i am open for personal readings make sure you guys go ahead and check out the description box below or if you guys would just like to donate to the channel support the channel see different cards because that where that's where the donations go they go to different cards and things like that go ahead and check out the description box below i love and appreciate each and every one of you so much leap of faith y'all know i don't do this for play play y'all know i don't do this for play play taking a risk stepping into the unknown Stepping into the beauty of the unknown and declutter. Let go of old items. Create new space. Create new sacred space for yourself. Listen, Capricorn. I feel like this person has been decluttering their life. They are getting ready to take a leap of faith here towards you, with you. And you have to be gentle. Let me just be honest. You're going to have to be gentle. I feel like this person may actually have a, a water moon, uh, moon sign, to be honest with you. Everything has a higher purpose. Yeah, divine timing. Everything has a higher purpose and everything is happening in its own divine timing, Capricorn, right? And you can't rush it. You can't push it any farther than it needs to be pushed. You have to truly allow this to happen. Um, so let it happen, right? Just let it, let it happen. You have manifested this person, this energy, this time. Um, let it come through in the way that it needs to come through. It's not always going to look how you have it in your fairy tale brain, right? It's going to look the way it needs to look in order for it to actually occur in the physical, which we know is not based off of our own um, fantasies. Anything else we need to see here about Spirit for Capricorn, Tuesday, November 5th, 2024. Mm -hmm. This situation involves marriage. This is, whoa, either you're meeting somebody that you're going to be marrying or you are communicating with the person that's going to be 
your, wow, reconciliation, your long-term partner. I'm going to leave this here, Capricorn. If you found this insightful and that it resonated, again, make sure you guys smash that like button. Of course, always your comments are welcome down below. Don't forget to make sure you are subscribed. Uh, what I am going to do is take this daily into a members only um, extended. So it will not be offered as a regular extended at all. It will only be offered to the members. So members, make sure you go ahead and check out the video. I will put it up here for you guys to check out. Um, and we'll go a little bit deeper into this message. If you guys would like to join the channel membership, go ahead and check out the link below on how to join. Otherwise, I will see you guys in the next one. And I love and appreciate each and every one of you so, so much. Thank you for joining.